go to the view menu and down to new guide layout. However, if it's not there, if you're using an early version, and the reason I'm doing this video is because someone contacted me and said, well, there is no new guide layout. And I think that was added a fair time ago, but you might just have new guide. Now you notice I've got a shortcut there. This makes it a bit easier with shortcuts, so you can do something like Command or Control Zero or something else. And you can set it Edit and down here to Menus. Not certain on the Photoshop Windows if that's in a different location, but you can customize your menu and you can add a shortcut. So what you do, go to View and New Guide. Very quickly, just there and select that. And you can set it up. You've got here Horizontal. And you can also see you've got a position, and that's useful because what you can do, you can turn around and say 100 or 200, say. Just enter that, and it will create it at that position 100. Now you can move it, use the Move tool, you can move them around backwards and forwards, but it's not very easy to be very precise. As you move it, if you move it, you'll notice what happens. It says 59.5. To actually exactly get it to be 100 position or whatever, a certain position, I find it tricky. Unfortunately, at least you can undo that. I didn't know it was going to do that, actually. It could have quite possibly not allow for undo for moving the guides. That would have been not very useful. But you can move it around. But personally, I prefer just to go to View and New Guide. And again, exactly the same as before. This time, into 200. So you get another one. This time I'm going to use a shortcut. So Command-0 or Control-0, depending on what you're on and then enter 300. Command zero. So you can do it quite quickly without that guide layout. It's not as quick, of course. 500, you have to just manually enter it. 600. And now, of course, you might say, well, I want the other direction as well, vertical. Well, again, command zero. Luckily, luckily, it remembers this, the vertical. It doesn't go back to horizontal, etc. It goes vertical. It's a pity it doesn't keep the last value that you enter. Would be nice. You can enter 100 there, click OK, and you can see now you can rapidly build up your guides. So it's exactly the same as the other one, and Command Zero, and then 300, and so on. You can see you can build it up very rapidly like that. However, it'd be nicer if you could, of course, use good old new guide layout, but if it's not there, fortunately, you have to go with new guide. What you can also do, you can lock the guides and you can just clear them if you don't want them anymore. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.